Proper motion. This is the observed rate at which a nearby star appears to slide against the backdrop of seemingly motionless stars. Imagine driving down a highway. Your car is the sun. Cars traveling at the same speed seem to stick with you but closer ones show changes more noticeably. Similarly, the nearer star's movements are more apparent to us. And then there's parallax. Have you ever noticed how a straw looks bent in a glass of water? That's refraction, and Earth's atmosphere does something similar to starlight. Near the horizon, this effect is strongest, making stars appear to rise early and set late by a few minutes. It's like the universe giving us extra daylight. So, do stars move or do we move? The answer is both. The Earth spins, making the stars appear to move across the sky, but stars themselves are zipping around their own orbits, traversing billions of kilometers annually. It's all about distance, those faraway stars seem stationary because of how immensely far they are. Now, Edwin Hubble, yeah, the guy after whom the Hubble telescope